Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today I'm out with the Sony a7R5 and the 7200 f2.8 from Sigma. This lens is super light, everything is internal, you've got a manual aperture ring as well, but we're going to see how this handles at night time in the city of London. Okay, so first shots we're going to get, we're at 200mm, we've got these cyclists here. That was at 200 of a second, f2.8 ISO 2000. Too slow for this bus. Maybe this bus behind this one. People at the top. I'm just getting the hang of this lens because I haven't shot with it yet. There's a taxi at the lights. So I'm gonna see if I can get that. Well, it's all parked up. Hopefully I'm not gonna get run over. No, he's going straight, cool. There's also people going across the street. So still at 200 mil, 200 of a second, f2.8, ISO 2000. Hey, are you Dan Green? Oh, Good to you. see you, bro. You, Dan Green, I want to go and follow Dan Green on Instagram. Whoa, hey Dion, how are we? Good to see you. This Hello, is Dion, welcome, everybody. I've got to lean well yeah, back we to get you in. <laughs> Dion, down in the description, Dan is also in the description as well. We're walking around this evening, just capturing London. Okay, so let's see if I can get this person at the top of the bus here. The reason I love 200 mil, well, 7200, I love this focal length because at 200 mil, you get that really nice compression, firstly. And secondly, you can get really nice shots from further away. Now, I know that it's not a typical street photography lens and I'm not, out here telling stories i'm out here capturing the people of london in their natural habitat without invading their space and i think a lot of the time when you're at like 28 mil or 35 or 24 you have to get up close and personal and potentially making people feel a bit awkward so we're at 135 mil okay so that last shot was at f4 Hundreds of a second, ISO 2000. I've come into Soho, well, we're walking down into the Soho area, um, and there's some people sat in the coach and horses opposite me, which I think will be a really cool shot. Um, I think landscape, 200 mil. Oh, that's nice. And maybe get this one, because they're, they're kind of framed a bit better. Definitely looks better in landscape than it does in portrait, but we'll get one in portrait. I'm going to change the focus area to wide and let the lens do its thing. I'm actually going to put it in singles, which is quite nice. It's going to set the tone for the rest of Soho as we walk down into the, the streets of Soho. So we're going to, I'm going to go left here. Or uh, we'll go straight. So there's a dude sat here on his phone. I just really like the lighting on him. as the car pulls in front of me. Thank you. Cheers, bro. Thank you. Appreciate it. <laughs> it's actually quite a nice shot. So there's a, a couple, well, two people sitting in the window and I'm trying to frame it where it says one kiss in the background between the two of them. So I'm going to get a shot of this street here with the neon sign down the end but i'm going to come further up the road to shoot it at 200 mil i think if i get down i'm just waiting for somebody to be walking up the street which will give it a nice it's quite a nice frame the guy in the window but silhouetted that was really sick just waiting for somebody to come in or out of the the pub here or even just walk in front of it but i do want one person i don't want multiple people there's a dude there maybe it'll like line up at the right time okay i've got this frame before but i haven't got this frame 
at 200 mil. And with the lights and everything, that's really nice. Testing the autofocus on this. Change the focus area to center. Which is really nice with the, uh, the neon lights. The dude enjoying his night, really nice. So far with the Sigma 7200, I'm actually really enjoying it because it's not too heavy. It's not too bulky. It is a little bit too long. I think in comparison to like the Sony, this is longer, but I do like that this is cheaper. Um, on the side, you have a bunch of different options. Um, and as we just worked out, there's a focus mode here. So if you want it to have full focus area, so where it's gonna focus on everything from its minimal focus distance to its maximum focus distance, and you want that slider all the way to the left, if you want it from three meters to infinity, you want it in the middle. And if you want it just to three meters, you want it all the way to the right hand side. And the reason I found that out is because it wasn't focusing properly. So I had to find out the reason why. And that was the reason why. Now I've got it on full focus mode and it is super quick with this focusing. So I'm thinking a nice compressed shot shooting down Chinatown at 200 mil. Disto, dis oh yes, there's, there's somebody. 200 mil, if he's quick enough, of course. We're at 125th of a second, f2.8, ISA 1600. I think I'm gonna get this shot in landscape. So I'm gonna get this shot in landscape. Oh, that's nice. So 125th of a second, F2.8, ISO 1600. Dude down here, we're at 160 of a second, F2.8, ISO 1600. The guy just chilling there having his break, obviously been quite a difficult day. Okay, so there's a couple sitting on the bench down there. And I'm just gonna jump across behind them and get a really nice shot, because it's very cute, because she's like leaning on his shoulder. And then you have the background, which is really nice. I think from here, you're at 200 mil. I think maybe if we go That's a nice frame. Just wait for this cyclist to go past. What do you think of it so far? Well, the lens, I actually think it's really good. I think the size is nice. It's not too heavy. It's not too bulky. Like it's quite thin. I feel ergonomically it's quite nice. And it's not too heavy like to hold out. Like I could probably hold that out for a good three minutes. But that's how we shoot. Well, how I'm shooting because of the video. Normally I would have it against my eye, which is actually not that far. It's actually better like that. Yeah. So I think it's, it's not too bad because otherwise it's too close and your hand's gonna catch on this. Okay. Yeah. Nice reflection of all the lights here. I think if I do this at 100, That's a nice vibe. So I'm just getting a person who is stood just outside the train station over there. I think if I go this side, like here. Yeah, that's good. 200 mil, 100 of a second, F2.8 ISO 2000. Is that an all red bus? Yeah. There's a red London bus just going in front of Big Ben here and I'm hoping I can get a shot of it just as it goes in front of the frame. It's not much light on it though, unfortunately. Sad. Maybe I can bring it out and post. If I did, it's on the screen. If I didn't, well, it's on the screen. So a while back, I got a shot here, which is of 
the station down there, but I didn't have a 200mm lens on me. And now that I do, it means that I can actually get a shot of inside the station from back here. So 200mm, and because I'm using the A7R5 with the high megapixels, I should be able to crop in and get a cool shot. Nice shot of this couple, I think. Oh, oh that looks sick. 200mm. Two people walking across the bridge. I think actually if I go to 135. We're at 50th of a second. F2.8 ISO 2500. Yeah, lads, alright? Yeah, look at these two just. Living the dream. They're just. Just taking it all in. Just listening to me waffle. You guys are all watching this video and enjoying it, but at least you have to listen to me talk absolute crap <laughs> for three hours. Sorry. So, sorry. So, so, sorry. <laughs> so I'm going to get a shot at 70 mil in front of Big Ben. Nice. All right. So we're heading down towards Westminster Bridge. I'll get some shots of like Big Ben, maybe some buses and stuff in the foreground. Um, and then we'll head up towards Trafalgar Square in that area and probably finish around there. Gonna get a shot of people on the top of the bus. Dude at the back of the bus. Maybe a 70 mil shot. Maybe the person in the actual like bus stop might be a good shot. Sick. You good? Good. I'll catch up. There you go. Do 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 do